Why? Now the way you win and lose races in the Rocket Racing League, it really has nothing to do with how fast your rocket is, because all the rockets have exactly the same design. The way you win and lose races is you most effectively manage your energy space given the constraints of the rockets and the airplane. So if modeling and simulation that the scientists are going to do to try to determine the most okay, effective way to go these rockets to win races. Well, you've got to ask, uh, is it possible eventually to have engines yeah. that have throttles on them? Yeah. Or would that take some of the fun out of it? Well, that's a question for yeah. Peter. Uh, we, we are looking at throttle engines, but of course, right now, it's all about how the pilot uses their energy. And you can go.
this time I saw the fly in the Oshkosh, and they were a lot higher than that. And as you say, as time goes on, this is going to be right down on the head, and you're going to see that rocket kind of eyeball to eyeball, and it will be something wonderful. It's landing in front of us. And this vehicle has three miles, coming like a space shuttle as a glider. No go rounds. Are you taking video? Yes. Cool. We're getting ready to launch. Why are you here today? It's going to give us an aerobatic launch by a national champion. But you're here for. Boy Scout, how about that? Yeah, uh, 